Hello everyone. Did you know that your phone's built-in voice recorder can hear everything around you? Every word you say, even when you're not using your phone? Of course, many people don't pay attention to this, but firstly, having it running in the background 24-7 from morning until night drains your battery. But the most negative consequence is that all the apps installed on your phone can access your microphone and secretly transmit information. Personally, I wouldn't want anyone eavesdropping on me or transmitting my voice, as it could be a virus. Then your phone could become the property of intruders. In short, I strongly recommend double-checking these simple settings I'm about to show you, and you'll feel much more secure than before. Furthermore, what we're doing now will only improve your phone. It will work faster and last longer without recharging. Support this video by liking it, subscribing to the channel, and sharing it with your friends. So, we need to use our default settings. Go to Settings, find the Apps section. That's it. Then tap all apps here. On the right, we have a permission. Tap that. Then, in those settings, look for the Auto Start and Background Mode option. It might just be called Auto Start. Regardless of your phone model or Android version, you'll have it. If you can't find it in those settings, when you go to the default settings, there's a search bar at the top. You can just type in the word auto start or background mode. Go there. If you've never been here before, I'm sure you'll have a lot of different apps running. Look, I'm scrolling. Almost all of them are in auto start mode on my phone, which means they're running in the background when they need to. When there's an internet connection, they're downloading some data, sending something to their servers, and showing various ads. Basically, there's a constant flow of data going on all day long. Even when you're not using any of those apps, they'll be running for you like this. So, on the right side, you can see that this is really draining the battery. So, as a first step, I recommend going through each app and enabling only a couple of apps that you use frequently. The rest can be safely disabled, and this will give you a nice boost in battery life. But right now, we're talking specifically about your microphone, your voice recorder, and the fact that we might be being listened to. Look, I have sliders that can be disabled. For example, to make it clearer, on the right, we have three dots. Click here. And here we have a menu called Show System Apps. Now, pay attention. I click Show System Apps. You see, the voice recorder appears. It's always active, always on. Even if we're not using it, some access is always happening. Look, now it all depends on your phone. First, click on the voice recorder. You see, I click, nothing happens. If you go to some menu after clicking, you'll have two sliders. I've already shown this in previous videos. Basically, you need to turn off these two sliders first, then exit and disable the app completely. If that's not the case, if after pressing it you don't go to any menu, it means you already have the latest updates installed, and you just need to disable this slider. Look, I'm disabling it, but of course, that won't be enough. I'll show you other important settings that affect everything in general. Let's exit this menu so it's clear where we're going. Go back to our standard settings and look for the Applications section. Now look for the word, Permission. By the way, when we entered, All Applications, it was there too, but this is not it. So we go here, Permission. Here we're interested in the system settings shown on the right. How many apps are allowed to change system settings? If we go here, you'll see that at the moment I have everything disabled. I've already shown this several times. Here you need to disable everything. All these apps will continue to work as they were. They don't need to be configured without you. Something on your phone. When I first got here, I had about two apps, including Voice Recorder. Once disabled, it completely disappears from this list. So go here, double check what you have here, and disable everything. Disabling is very simple. There will be icons for Always Allow. Just click on this icon, and a menu will appear. And here you select Deny. Then completely exit this menu. Go back to the standard settings. Look for the Applications section. Go to Permissions. And now Application Permissions. Go here and an additional menu opens, which we definitely need. 
Here we are specifically interested in the microphone. We are talking about not being eavesdropped on. So we go to the microphone settings. This will be divided into several columns. Allowed, always allowed, ask every time, and blocked. Again, if you've never been here before, you will 100% have something in the always allowed column, since almost every app tries to access the microphone, and then it remains in this column unless you manually change something. Games, for example, and various bloatware apps, as well as apps that don't need a microphone at all, can also appear here, which raises many questions about why they need one. You see, I'm scrolling through all these apps. They were in the allowed section. If you have a specific app that controls your microphone, leave it in this section. But I recommend disabling everything so that no apps appear in this column. If any app requires access to the microphone, it will launch simultaneously with the app you tap on the home screen. After you disable everything here, double check the second column. Ask each time, because sometimes there's no option to disable, but there is an option to allow only while in use. It will appear here, and then you can move it to the disabled column. Check if there's any logic between any of these apps and your microphone. For example, when you launch the camera, the microphone turns on. Obviously, if you're shooting video, access to the card's microphone is required. If you're searching for a location using voice input, then yes, of course, the phone should be listening. There could also be camera apps. Camera apps like TikTok. If you're filming videos or live streaming, that makes sense. But there could also be games. For example, apps like video editors. Why would they need access to the microphone? No taking apps, browsers, email, and so on. There might be apps that don't need the microphone at all. Again, I recommend disabling everything here so that there aren't any apps in this column. If an app needs access to the microphone, it will launch when you launch this app. Once you've disabled everything, exit settings and go back to our standard settings. Here, you'll need to use the standard search because many people can't find it. Just tap on the speaker, and you'll find the conversation speaker app. It's a system app linked to your voice recorder. If it doesn't work through the speaker, you can try entering similar words into the microphone or using similar words. The translation may vary on different phones, but the setting will definitely be there. Go to the speaker settings, then go to the advanced settings of the voice recorder itself, and clear your data there. Tap clear, and then tap OK. This is simply to clear the app's cache in case anything unnecessary has accumulated. After this, you'll feel more secure with your phone. Subscribe to the channel, leave comments, and like.